We didn't get it, Orex. I'm sorry. How long? Three months. At best. There you go, then. Everyone gets <laughs> cancer. You'll be Roderick's. My granddad had cancer of the bum. He said that was OK. I reckon Grandma was a bigger pain in the house. <laughs> Welcome back. We're having a chat with Right to Die campaigner Dr Nicole Farmer. Tell us about this machine you've developed. You're looking for a volunteer, aren't you? Not that simple. Where do I find you when I get to Darwin? Driving? Are you really going to do this? I've never been more sure of anything in my life. I miss your Rex. OK, dog. <laughs> Shit, shower and shovel. What are you going Darwin for? None of your business. Gentlemen, what do you want? Well, I want to play football. And he wants to kill himself. Two beers, then. You been training, Tilly? No, but I wanna. Hey, he's the best full forward in the history of Udna Dada. And if he's not gonna play for your mob, he's gonna play for that mob over there. <laughs> you and I have to be 100% sure that this is what you want. Rex, how hard has it been to convince your loved ones that the decision you're about to make is the right one? There's no one else. Just me. Billy Eric, put your window down. <laughs> Isn't he? You're gonna be a difficult patient. More than likely. Tell me about her. She's my neighbour. She has a nice smile. She's like the sun coming up when she flashes it. I wouldn't say that to her face. What did you think you were doing? I didn't want to be there. What? Are you gonna do this thing? Five years ago. I was going to ask you to marry me. I'm a cab driver, Doc. So I'm going to drive my cab until I 